Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on Cullen's sign. Cullen's sign is used to describe periumbilical ecchymosis, which means bruising at the area surrounding the umbilicus, shown in this picture. It is associated with many conditions, mostly hemorrhage. The more common causes are retroperitoneal bleeding, post-surgery, iatrogenic causes such as anticoagulation complication, and rectus sheath hematoma. Other less common conditions are ectopic pregnancy, intrahepatic hemorrhage, ischemic bowel, ruptured abdominal aortic aneurysm, amoebic liver cyst, perforated duodenal ulcer, ruptured spleen, and hepatocellular carcinoma. For its mechanism, it is mainly due to retroperitoneal bleeding. The retroperitoneum is connected to the gastrohepatic ligament, then the falciform ligament, and finally to the round ligament, which tracks to the abdominal wall around the umbilicus. When a hemorrhage from any cause occurs, blood is able to move along these ligaments to the abdominal wall to produce ecchymosis, hence causing the Cullen sign. For its sign value, although often still taught as being a sign of pancreatitis, Cullen sign is very nonspecific. In fact, in a study of 770 cases of pancreatitis, only 9 patients exhibited Cullen sign. In patients with acute pancreatitis, a mortality rate of 37% has been quoted in the presence of Cullen sign. So not all pancreatitis cases will have this sign, but if this sign is present, it increases the mortality rate of the patient. That's all for this video. Thank you.